When working with assemblies, it can be easy to accumulate lots of mates. And with the new option to group mates in SolidWorks 2019, users will find it much easier to navigate the mate folder. Now you can group mates by status or separate fasteners. When grouped by status, mates are separated into folders. This assembly has 100 solved mates. Two mates are missing a reference and are grouped in the errors folder. Mates can be edited as usual. In this case, a new reference can be selected and SolidWorks takes care of repairing other mates with the same missing reference. Another folder contains mates that have errors due to overdefinition. Suppressing these two mates will eliminate the error and place them in their own folder. Another folder lists mates that reference missing components. And finally, there's a folder for inactive mates that reference fixed components. As you can see, the new group mates option makes it much easier to keep your assemblies organized. Many users prefer to have all of their toolbox components fully defined in their assemblies. And you can see the fasteners in this assembly have an underdefined symbol in front of them. An option is available to lock the rotation of all concentric mates with one click. Now all of the fasteners in this assembly are fully defined, saving a great deal of time when compared to doing it individually. In SolidWorks 2019, there's now an option to automatically lock the rotation of all new concentric mates to toolbox components upon insertion, saving even more time and keeping your assemblies fully defined and conforming to best practices.